So this is a tutorial how to use the Matic Network and Quick Swap. So with the Matic Network, and I'll get into why I'm trying to get involved with Matic, which is layer two. So first, I'm the Ethereum Network. I need to be able to go on the Matic. So I'm going to search Matic. I make sure it's Matic Volume Two. So Matic Network, Matic web wallet version 2 make sure there's version 2 there network login i need to connect with my ethereum account with my metamask bot the ethereum version because later on you also need to have matic on your metamask account which we can look at setting up so connect and matic is basically a new ecosystem that works on layer 2 because if you think about ethereum is basically layer 1 so it works on its own blockchain but it's got very high gas fees so that's why these layer two solutions are things that can work off chain and be able to sign in do things like loads of things loads of blocks off chain on a new like ecosystem and then send it back to ethereum so what have i got here it's telling me this is how much ethereum i have so I did do this early actually with what, cause I've already farmed and done what I'm gonna show now, but because I wasn't recording or the recording went bad, but what we do, so you got to here, make sure it says wallet ver version two, cause we're trying to bridge from, cause remember some tokens can't talk to each other. So Bitcoin can't talk to Ethereum, Ethereum can't talk to Bitcoin, there's different blockchains. Matic can't talk to Ethereum, there's different blockchains. So the way to do bridge, so you can bridge that by transferring like this Ethereum, I'm gonna swap it to wrapped Ether that can communicate with the Matic blockchain system. So move funds to Matic main network. So here I can click on my max. It might need some gas fees though, so I don't know how much it will. I'm just gonna try see for 15 minutes. So make sure this says proof of stake bridge and then click transfer. Tells it's going to take seven to eight minutes. Continue, complete, continue. Uh, Matic network, continue. And then I made sure I pick high gas fees. So here you can go edit and click fast. Now I don't have enough, but that's what you would have done. Click fast and save. And then it would have went through, you could confirm, and then you would be able to see it on your meta. You'll see it down here. It would then tell your Matic network how much ETH you have available, and it'll be down here. But we've already done it. So then if I go to my MetaMask account, then I click here to Matic main network. If you didn't have a Matic main network, then you'll go to custom RPC, and you'll be able to add, if you go to custom, You'll be able to add the Matic details. For example, you could just write add in MetaMask, add in Matic network to MetaMask. The config document will come here. There'll be a picture. And these details, because it's a picture you can't copy and paste, but these details you would add to your MetaMask account here and click OK save and then it will be called my network main net like i got so you would have all these there and click save then you'll be able to go on to it so now i'm on to it I can go back so click home now i've already done it but i would have had you would have seen i sent my map my matic would have um my eth would have been here so we wrapped eth here before i tried to add the wrap eth but adding it didn't work it will come by itself and why i did this is because i wanted to get some matic and get some quick swap which is the exchange formatic just like binance has binance and pancake swap is the one for binance and people are going to binance because ethereum is too expensive and stuff There's the same thing with this matic has a big potential because it's solving this problem which we call actually we call it the blockchain Try blockchain. Try trilemma. So the blockchain trilemma. Let's look at the pictures. 
because it needs to be able to be scalable and have security and decentralize i was going to pick layer two and most people say tokens cannot do all of these at one go it can only do two things so solving a blockchain trilemma because this is why i realized i didn't have no layer two in my uh wallets so decentralization this is the core component of what it means to run a blockchain system decentralization allows networks to be permissionless and censorship resistant so it's about no one not one party controls it. it's not a central organization then it needs to be security safe there needs to be scalable so things can happen fast we can see bitcoin if you have only managed to gain a combined market cap over it's an old old one actually but they can't do transactions that fast so this is the problem it can't get global use edge and mainstream people using it if it's not scalable cannot work so this is the problem so all coins have tried to get better one lightning network bitcoin so Lightning network is called a layer two solution its primary purpose is to extend the capacity of existing blockchains so that transactions can be cheaper and more frequent because it's what we need for it to be get a mass global using it smaller less significant transactions are stored off chain so off chain i can do all the smaller transactions and stuff and they're bundled up and validated independently by small communities before being sent back to the main blockchain so this is the layer two so i can do things like matic is here layer two doing loads of transactions transaction stuff before it sends it back to Ethereum layer one to be able to be processed as one single payment. So it's really good. Speaking of, in a way, think about a grocery store. So imagine you do shopping every day, but instead of paying at the cashier every day, you just do your shopping every day. But then at the end of the month, all what you spent is put into one bill and then you send it to cashier as one payment. So that's what makes things quicker rather than you have to queue up every day to do your shopping and keep going to the cashier every day. Instead, just do your shopping at the end of the month, your whole bill's calculated and just pay off one go. So this is how layer two basically works. And that is why Matic, which also was known as, this is old name, so Matic Network, Matic Network. And this is what Matic, is come to do what is my network my network is a layer two scaling solution that achieves scale by utilizing side chains for off-chain computation while ensuring that asset security using the plasma framework because the plasma framework is from what uh here so we know lightning was for bitcoin then plasma is for ethereum so plasma is created by butterin and bitcoin lightning network co-creator joseph poon it's another layer two solution that is similar to lightning network with plasma child chains are created on ethereum blockchain the main chain with their that's why it's called blockchain you literally have chains collecting data Remember, blocks are just like ledgers co collecting information back in there you have accounts collecting all information about who sent me this who sent me that who i need to send so it's just ledgers basically accounts so that's a block but all the blocks are linked together with a chain and bitcoin had proof of work so the longest chain was proven to be the most safest and you couldn't get the longest chain if you didn't with it's about computing power to have the longest chain and things like that but ethereum is trying to move on to proof of stake which is a different system but that would help some of their gas fees but for now ethereum is still on proof of work so that's why it's very very slow and unscalable so while it's still on that people are able to do layer two solutions to work off of it off chain and then only send it to ethereum as one go so it should speed things up real quickly which is what i did see because when i did it i saw some small small fees so this is what is exciting about matic so i basically sent it so you would have saw it here then we can go to quick swap and quick swap is also available on so quick swap exchange, you would have wrote quick swap and then we'll go to swap. So in the swap is where I went to and I would have changed my ETH. So I don't have ETH anymore, but I would have went ETH here, used my ETH and then I would have changed it to Matic is what I've done. So what I did do, I had 0 0.5 ETH. So I took a half of that, so a quarter of that and changed it to Matic and then you click enter, then it'll give you the code and all of that so like here i could switch it so I could switch go max 
See if it will let me change. But what I did do was the ETH. Because I did that bridging thing to change my ETH from the Ethereum network to the Matic network. So that's what we did from before here. So that was the point of bridging from the Ethereum network to a wrapped ETH on the Matic network. Then you would have seen it on your QuickSwap account. You would have wrote ETH. So I can go max. But I'm not really doing it now. But that's what we've done. So you use the swap to change from Matic. Change from Ethereum to Matic, and I also did Ethereum to QuickSwap because the point of me doing that, remember, for finding for farming, you need to do uh, pairs. So I did that to be able to create a pair to add liquidity. So I wanted my Matic and I wanted a QuickSwap. So I went here, went max quick. So insufficient Matic balance. Let me try max. Matic would that work? But when I had enough before, and then you click max, and then you would be able to click here. It will say uh, approve. Then it will go through MetaMask. You will see the fees were very, very small. It was very nice. And then you supply yourself with the tokens. And after I supplied myself with the tokens, so that would have been there. Then you can go to Quick Swap here. And then here is where you would pick the pair that you want to pull and farm with. So I went down to uh, Quickomatic. And then now it says manage because I've already put it in there. It would have said deposit. And then I would have depressed deposit. And it's telling me so much we'll get 50 quick. 50 quick a day. I haven't worked out yet. I think so. The whole deposit will get 50 quick a day shared between them. That's how it must work. So already, I only did this like 10 minutes ago. So this is what I put. And half of that is from Matic and half of that is from the pair of um, Quick Swap. So Quick and Matic. Yeah. So it says it there. And then later on i could withdraw this that it's made so it's making this per day actually so this must be my share of that so i probably could do some maths and work out so it's 50 quick a day for this whole total deposit for a whole four million my sh percent my share of that is this so this is how much i can make a day but i'm making so the whole point of this is your farming you're getting api you're getting yield for free especially in the best case scenario my quick will be going up in value so what i didn't mention quick you can see here it's already done thousand percent in 14 days so 10x so imagine if you put one pound you would have 10 pound if you put 100 pound you would now have what i mean if you put 10 pounds you would have 100 if you put 100 pounds you have a thousand things like that so we'll see i think it's very new all time low 15 days ago so i think if i'm correct i think it just come yeah i'm gonna look into that more but the point was i was excited about getting layer two because at the end of the day ethereum i've already got some ethereum i don't have to swap ethereum for to be able to get into matic and quick swap i've already got ethereum so i'm also farming ethereum and wife dies see a previous video where i'm farming with that because wife dies got a airdrop coming so i've got a previous video you can see where i'm doing that so i've already got wrapped i've already got eth linked with that because remember you can unstake unpotate the give them back the liquidity pool tokens and they'll give me back the two pairs of tokens i had so in best case scenario quick swap will be going up then let's see matic because it's just about which are now polygons just about making your tokens do something so instead of just sitting there they're also doing something so Matic as well, you can see how they're doing. So in 14 days, they've gone 113%. So you would have doubled your money, whatever you put. So I'm going to run out of 